Hey man, we back up in this bitch one more again. This Ross Media. You dig what I'm saying? The realest from the shy. You dig what I'm saying? Southside. You know what I'm saying? Big belly nigga. You be a skinny motherfucker running the motherfucking blocks. But hey, check this out though. That nigga Terrence Crawford did his motherfucking thing. He, he did it. He did his thing. And he took and he took a couple little punches. It really wasn't shit though, but he swole his eye up a little bit. But you know what I'm saying. But what he did was he he pretty pressed on the gas a little bit. He was sitting there trying to figure him out. You know what I'm saying. And then when he seen that all that the man had, Kell Brook had, then you know my man's put him down the way he's supposed to put him down. Um. Shout out Kel Brooks, but your time is over with, bro. Retire. You you just fighting for money at this point. Anything after right now, after what I just seen, you just fighting for money. You come in, you talking, you the bigger man, you this, you that, and all this and that. That the size don't mean anything in a fight, man. Skill means everything. Skills and having a chin, being able to take a punch because you is gonna get caught eventually. And and my homeboy, Terrence Crawford, you did what I'm saying? He displayed that he had a chin. You know what I'm saying? Because Kale Brook was all talking about, I'm the bigger man, I'm naturally bigger, and I'm coming down, and I'm doing this, and you know what I mean? Uh, all that shit sounds good, but both of you motherfuckers weighed in on 147. So, and then the next day, you just, 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 you'll be just so much stronger than, no. I don't know, maybe it's, Miracle medicine or some shit, but he fopped him in the eye. He was like, fuck! Dead that, like, fuck! Dead that, that was a fuck! You know what I'm saying? That That's the name, that's, they gotta be the name of the sound. When he hit him, like, fuck! That was a fuck! He fopped his ass. Yeah. I thought it was gonna go longer, you know what I'm saying? I ain't no I ain't no chance to go take him out that that damn fast, you know what I'm saying? But he did, you know, and hey, hey it is what it is. Yeah it is. So now we wanna see that Terrence Crawford in that Spence. We gotta we gotta see that now. It's it's, it's kinda like I know, I know this for a fact. This this is the crazy thing about it, right? And then I can't say I know that for a fact. Because I was going to say Terrence Crawford would, would, would be because a better boxer than Earl Spence. But after Earl Spence did what he did to, to, to um, Mikey Garcia, I cannot even say that. I can't even agree with it. So, this is going to be who can take who punch. That's what it is. Who can take who punch, man. Straight up. Because if, if Terrence Crawford cracking, uh, you know what I'm saying, real welterweights weights. And, and, and knock him to the side like that. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Um, I don't know. But can he take? Can he take one from Earl Spence? That's the, that's the other thing, too. That's that's the thing. I don't think he's going to knock Earl Spence out and no shit like that. It was a major performance last night, but I don't think that's going to happen. But, um... I want to see that fight. I don't even know. I had to make my. I had to make my decision on who the fuck gonna win that fight. Who I, who I think gonna win that fight. Who I put my money on. Man, at first it was Earl Spence, but then after seeing what just happened, it's kind of like, huh, chance. Can it be chance? But I don't. I got my money on Earl Spence.